what is what we call a horizontal A deduction, right? Mm -hmm. So we'll come forward just a tad like this. Okay, hold the limb for you. Good. Now you see all of this <laughs> yeah. right here? Okay, all of this. That's all pectoralis major. Okay, good. And we've got to distinguish here because now he's up in, he's doing a horizontal A deduction. What else is helping that's up here in the front? Deltoid. Anterior portion of the deltoid. So we got to, we can feel the difference. Just run our fingers along like this. Okay. Pull it on and pull it. Now I'm pulling in backwards this way towards a horizontal A deduction so he resists me. So there's the whole muscle activated. Now if we want to differentially activate them, we want to see the clavicular fibers. We have them come up to about here. Okay, and we have them hold. Don't let me push you down. Right there. See what pops up? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those are the clavicular fibers. Why? Because they are flexors. Okay, hold it up there for just a second. Nothing's really happened. It's active, but if I resist him, hold. See what happens? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, those are the clavicular fibers. What do the sternocostal fibers do? They extend. So I'm going to bring them up here to about 120 degrees, like this. I'm going to say, hold, don't let me push you. Hold. And, okay, now I still get some, but not much activation up here. This is really active. Okay, so I'm going to come down a little bit like this. Hold there, don't let me pull you up. See how that all pops out on the bottom? And relax. Watch this. Hold. See that? And relax. Bring it up here. Hold. See that? Down here doesn't pop up. He does it. So that's how we distinguish between the upper and the lower fibers of pectoralis major. Now, the concern.